I cannot define the real problem. Therefore, I suspect there is no real problem. But I am not sure there is no real problem. The paradox of a quantum experiment is that its outcome can change depending on whether or not we choose to measure some property of the particles involved. And friends, consciousness is the same. Don't we hold on to two mutually exclusive ideas at the same time in our brain, just as quantum objects can apparently be in two places at once. Can consciousness be explained through ancient practice of yoga or the precepts of modern physics? It is different from space, time, energy and matter as we know. That's the subject for this Saturday.